I am Dr. Charlie Ware, President and CEO of Healer Blends Global. I'm going to tell you the top four things you should do when you are thinking you're in a pain crisis or you're in a pain crisis. One, of course, always identify if you are really into a pain crisis or if it's just some other type of pain that your, your body is experiencing. A lot of times patients come to me and say, I'm in a pain crisis, and then we have to identify if it really is a pain crisis. For women, it can be uh, PMS syndrome, or it can be, um, you can be ovulating. For men, it can be just the fact that um, you overworked out or you actually truly hurt yourself. So first and foremost, always identify. Two, dictate your level, meaning what are you doing to really get yourself out of pain really, really fast or really, really slow, meaning um, are you taking your medication? Have you hydrated? Have you soaked an Epsom bath? Um, have you taken your vitamins today? Have you taken your pain medication today? Um, all those things, again, you have to identify immediately. A lot of times I see patients, you know, I, I always ask, so when did the pain initially start? Oh, well, the pain started last night or it started yesterday. I, I'm trying to ignore I thought it would just work itself out. Yes, we want you to not overreact to the pain. We also want you to be very, very aware of the pain that this could go from zero to a 10 very, very fast. Now, many of you have um, told me that you experienced that where it's like in less than an hour it goes to zero to 10. So always identify it. But the first thing we don't want you to do is we don't want you to start popping pain medication. We want you to try to figure out different ways you can actually get rid of it. The third thing you can do when you're in a pain crisis, make sure that you're in an area where you feel safe and you feel comfortable, meaning do you have a bed to lie on? Do you have a recline to lie on? Are you, if you're in your car, have you, are you in an area where you can stop and rest and actually t take you know, five deep breaths to see if that's going to alleviate it as well? Because as soon as we start to feel the pain crisis, what a lot of patients do is they tense up. So the first thing you want to do is do as much as you can to, again, make yourself comfortable. And then, of course, you want to call your closest relative to make sure that they're aware of that you're in a pain crisis or you're feeling some pain so they can also aid you as well. Because, again, a lot of times this community, you know, we feel as if we we're completely alone. We don't, we don't want you to ever feel as if you're alone. We want you to make sure that you have someone that can sponsor you, someone that you can have that, 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 that phone or friend, uh, um, if you will. So make sure you also uh, establish that person that you, know, you can call and say, look, I'm in a little pain right now. I'm letting you know where I am. Um, and I just want to make sure that everyone's aware that I'm in a pain crisis so, uh, so you don't feel as if you're alone. The last thing, make sure you always, always do this. Make sure you go back over all the steps again. And if you need to go to the hospital, you go to the hospital. First, identify the pain and also the pain level. Two, make sure that all the steps you have done uh, as far as like preventing the, the pain crisis, the hydration, taking your pain medication, taking your vitamins for the day, you stretch, you put heat on, you also stretch, you do as many things as you can. And of course, you always, on the third level, Call a friend or family member to make sure you're doing all things correct. And if you need to go to the hospital, never hesitate to go to a hospital that you feel trusted. And also, and or call your um, personal physician to let them know what's really going on. We always offer as much education as we can here at, here at Healing Clinics Global. As you see that we, we're doing these videos, we're doing um, a lot of different blogs on, on our website. Just make sure that you guys have as much information and you feel comfortable. You don't feel as if you have to be alone with this. We try to make our videos as true and raw as possible because of the fact that I want you guys to see that we're not doing this you know, uh, as a marketing gimmick or whatever, make sure that this community is really, really being served. So we make sure that we have the information and make sure that you go over it over and over again. Because again, this is the way of life for you. This is the definite way of life. It's an everyday situation that you're also dealing with. We thank you for um, joining us with these videos. If you have any more questions, feel free to give us a call at 1-866-440-6243 or just visit our website at healablingsglobal.net. Take care.